Have you ever tried to dive into the source code of a website built with React, only to find yourself staring at a blank canvas? It's frustrating, right? If that's you, then you're in the right place. Today, we're going to uncover how to view the actual React components behind those websites. I totally get it. You open the developer tools and all you see is the root div. It feels like a puzzle with missing pieces. You're not alone in this. Many developers face the same challenge when trying to inspect React applications. Here's the specific question we're addressing today. One user asked, is there any way to view the React source code of websites built with React? They were frustrated because inspecting the page only revealed the root div and not the components. Sound familiar? Let's explore this together. So why does this happen? React uses a virtual DOM, which means the actual components are not directly visible in the source code. Instead, they are rendered dynamically. But don't worry, there are ways to see what's happening under the hood. And stick around. I have a handy tip at the end that will make inspecting React components a breeze. To view the source code of a website built with React, the user can start by opening the browser's developer tools. This can typically be done by right-clicking on the page and selecting Inspect, or by pressing Control plus Shift plus I. Once the developer tools are open, the user should navigate to the Elements tab. This tab displays the HTML structure of the page, but it may not show the React components directly. To see the React components, the user can switch to the React tab if available. This tab is part of the React Developer Tools extension, which needs to be installed beforehand. In the React tab, the user will be able to see the component hierarchy. They can click on each component to view its props and state, providing deeper insight into how the application is structured. Finally, if the user wants to see the actual source code, they can check the Sources tab in the Developer Tools. Here they can find the bundled JavaScript files that contain the React code. Fun fact, React was developed by Facebook and is now one of the most popular libraries for building user interfaces. It's like the Swiss army knife of web development. Now, let's look at the answers provided by other users. An alternative solution provided by another user suggests using two tools to view the source code of React websites. One tool has already been mentioned, and the second is Redux DevTools, which helps with state management. That wraps up that answer. Let's move on to another one. This user explains that to view the actual source code of a React website, you need source map files. Without them, you'll only see a vague, transpiled version of the code. They mention that when using Create React App, source maps are generated by default for each JavaScript file. This allows you to view the original source code in developer tools. Additionally, there's a tool called Unwebpack Source Map that can help recover uncompiled TypeScript and JSX sources from Webpack source maps. Here's the handy tip I promised. Always keep the React Developer Tools extension updated this ensures you have the latest features and bug fixes, making your inspection process smoother. And there you have it. You can now view the source code of React websites with ease. Remember, exploring the components can lead to better understanding and improved development skills. If you found this helpful, hit that subscribe button for more tips, and don't miss our next video on advanced React debugging techniques.